That's the battery manager. It tells you the voltage of the pack, uh, the kilowatts remaining. It's a nine kilowatt pack. The top and the bottom levels, voltage levels of the pack and the temperature of the pack. Right. So then you just select forward on the control panel, switch the key on and off we jolly will go. Well, it's good and smooth. Mm. So we're going to the cruise. So now it's setting out at about 70 amps. And it'll come down to about 50 amps, which is about 3 kilowatt in the cruise at 35. As soon as I take my foot off, you'll see for the corner, you'll see it uh, regen. Up to 250, 260 amps in regen. And accelerate around the other side again. Zero amps. Mm. No energy. I'm going to attempt some hill climbing there. What's it pulling down and it's taking us up here? It'll uh, be computer governed at about 280 at its uh, max, but because that's limited at 22, it'll mile an hour, it'll be less than that. Now. So we'll see. It'll So 22 and kilometers yeah. an hour is about 35, That's isn't it? That's it, and now we're doing about 30 mile an hour up the hill. So that must be 40 kilometers ish, I suppose, yeah. maybe a bit more. So really, it's quite comfortable with hill work. And it sticks to the road like glue, doesn't it? Oh, really, yeah. a smart so Exactly. And having your batteries low down as well helps, I suppose. Yeah, it's great. Low center of gravity. Mm. We should have taken a picture of the um, kilowatt hour meter when we left, because if we turn around and go back down, oh right, it's, it's gonna, it'll be zero. <laughs> it'll be back up to what it was, won't it? it? Not far off. But yeah. It's like the Val Terra, our biggest hill on the island. It's about 0.2 kilowatt hours going up. Yes. Turn around and go back down, and it puts about 0.1 back in. <laughs> so it's quite cute, really. so you'll notice, actually, we'll look if we turn around now at six kilowatt. Yeah. We'll turn around, and you'll see what it is at the bottom. So we've got six kilowatt hour in the battery now. Yep. 
so let's see what we can get on the bottom as we go down to the bottom of the hill. So as we accelerate, we'll go back down to six. Because that was just the deceleration yeah. of going into the... So we're back to six. Just so nice the absence of a petrol engine, isn't it? The mm. whistle of the just going along, drifting along, especially in somewhere like Guernsey. Yeah. Where really the petrol engine has no place, really, has it? <laughs> <laughs> using the brakes at all to follow this car. Just totally lifting, regen. Yep, lifting the accelerator pedal. How many amps are we putting in at the moment? What's the metre reading? At the moment we're putting in about 170 amps. We've gone up to 6.1 on the um, kilowatt metre. Just over six point, so it's point, point one of a kilowatt battery. So, how much did it cost us to go up the hill then in kilowatts? Well, um, it would have gone kilowatt hour, let's say. Yeah, um, well, it cost about point two to go up the hill. Thank you. So, point one of a kilowatt hour to, yeah. to, to mount the hill. Yeah. So, about half a penny and about a quarter of a penny put back in <laughs> on the way back there. So we're still running on that 6.1. See how far we go. You just feel that regeneration just grab in there. It's a And somebody said though, with all this regen, you have to go out and polish your discs every, every month. You have to take the <laughs> wheels off and polish your discs, otherwise they go rusty. Yeah, that's with harsh regen like we've got set here is that you have to have your brake lights coming in yeah. automatically on regen. On regen, yeah. Otherwise you get some very upset people. Exactly. <laughs> you can see we're still six kilowatt hour. So in in hilly country it's almost possible to travel for nothing almost. Well yeah it's it's not a huge um, downside as you would expect hills with yeah. a regen like this. No, no. 